What's up, guys? It's Dustin Conrad with Bands and Body Fitness, um, creator of the world's first ever portable deep muscle stimulator. And today I'm going to show you how to use it on yourself. So basically, we're going to go ahead and do the main areas that I would recommend, and I'm going to explain why we use it in certain positions. So basically, it's almost always going to be sideways like this, not flat like that sideways because it's orbital and it compresses so it goes back and forth and it goes in an orbital circular motion so to get the maximum benefit it's going to need to be sideways and i'm going to show you the areas that i would recommend which definitely would be the trapezius up in here where we hold a lot of tension so to do that i'd place it right there then i would turn the machine on and just vibrating those muscles loose you can go up into the neck area so going right up here and trying to stay away from the bone so you're on the actual muscle portion. From there, I'm gonna wrap my arm underneath the armpit, getting into the scapula. I'm gonna show you from behind back here so how I would do that. So from right there, I'm gonna go ahead and I can even use this hand to help the elbow to get back there more. And I would turn it on, same concept. Small circular motions, getting more into there. Staying away from the bone and just getting into that muscle, yes. All right, we're gonna move down into the lats. So here to loosen up this area, same concept. Just vibrating those muscles loose. Circular motions, applying the pressure as you would like. And awesome, cool. All right, the next thing we're gonna do is move on into some lower back stuff. So to do that, I might place both hands on the machine and guiding it. We'll favor one side at a time. Similarly, just like this. And then the other side. If you find any sensitive areas, you can just go ahead and press and hold in there. And you can apply pressure as needed. Okay, moving down into the glutes. We're gonna do the upper part here and then the main. So from there, same concept. I'm gonna start on this side actually. So it's gonna look something like this. And then down into the glutes. From there, you might use both hands to get more pressure. And out to the outside here. A lot of sensitivity there, I feel on myself. And relaxing, cool. We need the hip flexors and the psoas, so right here into this area. And then we'll move on down the leg. So right there, you're pressing into that area, just vibrating those muscles loose. You can do both sides here on this one. All right, we're gonna do the quadriceps. Now, ideally, you would wanna be sitting down so they're fully relaxed, but I'm just gonna show you standing since I'm already here. And um, similarly, we're just gonna do the inside of the leg circles. And then the top of the leg. And then the outside. And uh, back of the hamstring, same concept. We'll do the outside the back of the leg and then the inside of there and relaxing awesome we're gonna do the uh, calves next so I'm gonna crouch down a little bit to show you how this will work we're gonna do the outside of the leg all the way down towards the Achilles the back part and then the inside Similarly, on the front of the leg, staying away from the shin bone, but right on the meaty part of the outside will do. Great for shin splints. If you get shin splints, the inside, same concept. Especially right down here, if you have those shin splints, great area to loosen up. Another great area to do will be your forearms, especially if you have that tennis elbow or any tension down in here. So we're gonna do the top of the arm and then the bottom as well. So for the top, you're gonna to be over top like this, vibrating right around that meaty part before the joint. Flip it over, same thing. And then the shoulder, we're gonna do the inside part by the pectoral area especially great for if you have that rolling forward to loosen up that area and waken it up. Oh yeah, that feels good. 
and then right over the chest area. And then on the shoulder, outside of it. Down towards the elbow on the upper part of the arm. And great. And I'm showing you also, you know, I'm using obviously my dominant side, but it's just as easy to do with your non-dominant arm. And a great dexterity exercise as well. A great way to awaken up the muscles before you work them. A great way to alleviate all that lactic acid and toxins after you work them. Same thing above here. And right here on that inside part of the chest. And then over the chest muscle. Great. And then down here. And then on the outside of that shoulder. And then the forehead. Just kidding. Awesome. Great job, and you are all set. Congratulations on your purchase of the world's first ever deep muscle stimulator. Enjoy it. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out at info at bandsandbody.com or call us at 1-855-STRETCH. And don't forget to stretch beyond your limits.